Before we get started with this video, I'm giving 5 lucky subscribers $50 gift cards from Steam, Xbox and PlayStation. To enter to this giveaway, all you guys can do is just like this video, subscribe to my channel and comment down below what type of gift card you want with your username and you will enter to this giveaway. What's up guys, in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys an in-depth guide on how you guys can basically mod Marvel Rivals. So yeah guys, let's get to this video. So the new method to mod Marvel Rivals is similar to the old method. So I'm first going to be showing you guys how to do it on Steam and then I'm going to be showing you guys how to do it on Epic Games guys. So the first thing you guys got to do on Steam is basically go ahead and go to the Marvel Rivals game, right click on it, click on properties. Now in properties go ahead and go to install files and click on browse right over here and it should open up the Marvel Rivals game folder. So that is what you guys need and in Epic Games all you guys got to do is just cl click on these three buttons right over here and all you guys could do is just go ahead and go over to manage now in manage click on this right over here where it opens up the install location folder which is the marvel rivals folder so uh, yeah now uh, after you basically open this thing up all you guys could do is just go ahead and go over to marvel game go ahead and go to marvel content and packs right over here this is where you put your mods so first thing you guys gotta do is right click on this click on new and click on folder and type this in so what you gotta type is basically this it's uh, this thing right over here this symbol i don't know what to call this it's basically like right next to uh, like the uh, number one key so yeah you guys can do just type that in and after that type in mods just like this as you guys can see Create a folder like this guys, this would make the mods more organized and stuff like that and you would know what the mods are and what the actual game like pack files are, okay? So uh, yeah, after you've created this, all you guys gotta do is just basically put the newer mods in this mod file right over here. So for the newer people that's new to modding, uh, to download mods, all you guys gotta do is just go ahead and go into this website right over here. It is N-E-X-U-S, Nexus Mods is the website all you guys gotta do just enter that in click on enter and go ahead and go into this uh, mod website right over here guys okay so uh, yeah now once you're in this uh, website all you guys gotta do just first up go ahead and go and search put it to games and type in marvel rivals just like this as you guys can see this is where you should get your like uh, game uh, mod so any mod after february 25th should work with this new modding method any mod before uh, wouldn't work i will show you guys how to get older mods in a bit so uh, let me just show you guys how to get the newer mod so the first thing you guys gotta do is basically choose a mod that you guys want so i'm basically gonna get myself this mod and as you guys can see it is march uh, like 14th right over here this should work with the new uh, like modding method all you guys can do just download it manually right over here so after downloaded it all you guys can do just open it up with an extract uh, program that you guys have i'm using winrar all you guys can do is just open this up or extract it so as you guys can see i'm currently using winrar after you open it up it should look like this if you guys are not using winrar and if you're using like the default windows extracting or something like that all you guys can do just extract it first and it should give you guys this file guys okay so this pack file basically all you guys can do just put this pack file in the game uh, like mods folder that we created now after i've done that all you guys can do just simply launch the game so let me just show you guys And once you're over here, you guys can just go ahead and go over to the character that you got the mod for. I used the thing and as you guys can see right there, the mod works perfectly. So this is the Alan the Alien mod from Invincible if you guys didn't know. So let me just go ahead and go over to in-game to show you guys this mod too. And as you guys can see, it is working perfectly. As you guys can see. So uh, yeah guys, that is how you guys uh, do the new method to mod Marvel Rivals. Now let's get on to the old mods and how to work them. So this next method makes old mods work and you guys can work new mods with this next method too. This requires you to download mod manager. If you guys don't want to do that, you guys can just stick with the first method that I showed you guys earlier. First off, go ahead and go into Nexus and go ahead and go into Marvel Rivals and go ahead and go into popular all time right over here. Now once you're in here, go down until you see Repack Rivals 
levels right over here this is the mod you're going to be downloading to make old mods work so this doesn't mean that all the old mods work guys because some mods are still incompatible with the new marvel levels updates and stuff like that it would either crash the game or it wouldn't uh, like work basically if a mod basically crashes the game or it doesn't work that means that the mod is incompatible with this uh, new updates with marvel rivals guys okay so yeah now once you're in this uh, mod page right over here you guys can do just go ahead and go into files and download repack gui mod manager right over here you guys can download the old version too but it is way more complicated to actually make an old mod work but uh, this thing is insanely easy so i'm basically going to be showing you guys this one okay so i guess can do just basically download this just like that so as you guys can see i have already downloaded it earlier to uh, like uh, test it out and stuff like that so now i guess could do just go ahead and go over to your downloads folder and uh, locate the mod that you just downloaded called the repack gui now i guess you just click on uh, right click on it and basically click on extract to repack gui right over here do not click on extract here it would just make a mess of things and put the files everywhere click on this so it makes a new like folder guys okay so yeah as you guys can see after you've basically installed it all you guys can do is just to open it up and click on repack to ui right over here and you should open up this mod manager so uh, yeah guys now once you're in this mod manager all you guys can do is just uh, download the an old mod that you like and basically put the pack file in here and it should automatically download i have already done this with uh, like two mods so batman is like an old mod which came out when the game came out this one doesn't work guys this makes the game crash basically and uh, this one works this is old mods that's before february 25th and this one worked amazingly so let me just show you guys how this mod manager actually works so uh, first off you guys can do just choose a mod that you like so i'm basically gonna choose the benton right away here this is an old mod right over here i think it was updated uh, okay it is uh, like a uh, it's a new mod i think it's uh, like updated so let me show you guys how to actually like uh, use this mod manager you okay, guys can do just basically open up the like the mod and basically go ahead and go over to the pack file of it and just drag it and drop it into this and you should open up this thing and all you guys can do just click on install mod and it's that easy now you should have the mod installed just like that now simply like uh, launch the game and you should get yourself the mod And as you guys can see right over here, I am in the game. And let me just go ahead and go into Fantastic Four right over here. And as you guys can see, the mod manager works perfectly. And uh, yeah, upgrade right over here. I actually like this mod. Okay, so uh, yeah, guys, so that is how you guys can mod Marvel Rivals. And yeah, that's it from me, guys. I'll guess I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye bye.